Hello, my name is Dark Seal, and I have put together a tutorial for you. Uh, this is Poser Figure Creation with Dark Seal. I will take you through my process and setup on how to go from nothing to a completely finished character in Poser. Now, this series is mainly focused on the rigging itself of your character. Uh, we'll be taking a, an in-depth look at Poser's tools on how we rig a custom figure. What we'll do is we will start from scratch and end up with a fully articulate character like you see here. Character's got a lot of expression, a lot of facial morphs, but I will start from a simple sphere inside of ZBrush and I will sculpt a figure from scratch. I will retopologize him or uh, set up his edge loops to make him useful for our animation purposes inside of Poser. I'll be showing you how to edit your character files from the inside out. And of course, the main focus will be the rigging itself. I will show you how to prepare your character, what you'll need to do before importing him into Poser, and we'll go over a step-by-step -step process on how to actually rig our figure. I'll be showing you how to set up inverse kinetics or IK chains. I'll be showing you how to create master dials and what they can be used for. And of course, once we're finished, we'll have gone from a ball of nothing, just a polygon sphere, to this completely finished character, complete with movable limbs, eyeballs, facial expressions, textures, displacement maps, and of course I'll show you then some of my little tricks at the end on actually rendering him, bringing it into a program like Photoshop or uh, GIMP if you'd like to go the free route, and, uh, and get a completely finished great looking product. So, this is a 28-part series. It runs seven hours long, and it's very in-depth, very informative. It will show you exactly what you'll need to do to create a figure from scratch, whether you're making this character for yourself or a private commission for someone else, or if you'll be selling it in the many online marketplaces available for Poser products. The information seen here uh, was done in Poser Pro 2012, but all of the tips and tricks and items that I will show you will be available to use in all versions of Poser from Poser 6 forward. We'll be talking about weight maps, and we'll be talking a bit about subsurface scattering materials, but everything else will be valid from Poser 6 to the current version of Poser Pro 2012 or Poser 9.